Hey guys, Nitno here. Are you looking for morphine? Well, I got you covered. We'll go over a couple good spots to find morphine, and you'll get a couple in no time. First off, you should know that you can craft them with med station level 2. So if you have med station level 2, go ahead and craft those, and you'll knock them out that way. First off, we are going to be checking out this new area on customs. You're not going to need any expensive keys, no keys at all. Real easy, get in, get out. Hopefully there's a couple there, and they can extract. This is probably going to be a little harder at the beginning of the wipe when customs is packed, but for the most part, it's really not that bad. And you could do this at nighttime if you feel like it. After you go up the stairs, take a right, and you'll be going right in here on these tables. That's where you're going to find a couple morphine. This run, this is a live run, and I found three. So there you go. You can just imagine how many runs would take you to complete whatever quest you're doing. So that's a good example. I would definitely do that. And we're going to move on to reserve. All right, we are over on reserve at the White Bishop building. There's two optional keys, RBKSM, RBSMP. You don't need those keys, but it's going to give you two extra rooms. Also, we're not using a backpack because we're going to take the sewer manhole extract and can't use a backpack for that. Now, once we're inside, head upstairs. First off, we're going to check this room at the end of the hallway. On the floor, in these piles, that's where you're going to find your chance for a morphine. It does share a spawn with other medical supplies. This is the RBKSM key. That's going to be your first locked room. There's a morphine right there. And as you can see, a whole bunch of other medical supplies. Any of those spawns could be the morphine. So for the rest of this run, we're just going to be checking the floors. And we're going to be checking in the cabinets as well. Make sure to check out all the rooms that I've been looting in this video that we maximize your chance for that morphine. At the end of the hall here is going to be another locked room. That's the RBKSM. Pop it open and make sure to check the floors, the cabinets. Check that duffel bag. Now we're going to head downstairs and we're going to check out the first floor. Same deal. Check those piles on the ground. Check the stretcher. There can be meds there too. Make sure to check all the tables just to be thorough. For the rest of this video, I didn't find any more morphine, but all the places I'm checking and pointing at do have a chance for that morphine to spawn. So make sure to check the floors, check the shelves, stretchers, any of the places that I'm pointing out with my gun, make sure to check it out. There is another key that can spawn in that room on the chair. Make sure to check that. This room usually has morphine. There's so many supplies in there. Also check this orange crate. And I usually find them on that shelf as well. Now it's pretty much going to wrap up the spawns. There is a bag here that does have a chance. And that's pretty much going to wrap up reserve. Now we can go and head on over to the sewer extract. And then you can go ahead and requeue until you have all the morphine that you need. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, hitting that like button really helps me out with the YouTube algorithm. Also, if you want to see more content like this, hit that subscribe button. I really appreciate it, guys. As always, have fun in Tarkov. Take it easy. Peace.